Wall Street Memes Casino. I'm fine. And Sportsbook. Oh, you smell, man. <laughs> Gareth, how are you, mate? Come in, come in. I'm fine. Just thought I'd be encouraged. We're just talking about whether boxers are too sensitive. Well, Johnny is. He's always been sensitive. But, I mean, to the cameras, he's hard as nails. In the ring, he's hard as nails. But he's always crying into his soup with me in the evenings, telling me how shit his life is. Is that no, true? No, I'm joking. I'm joking. Listen, <laughs> um, are boxers too sensitive? Yeah, everyone's sensitive. I, I, it depends I, what it is. I think it's the people around the fighters. Fighters are, are tough cookies, and so if your camp saying, "Oh my God, you shouldn't have let him say this," oh my God, and they they taking things, they they they're hearing things out of context. So when they hear it, it's like, "Oh man, why would you say that?" Oh, like Chinese whispers. There's Chinese a lot of that. Chinese whispers, man. Chinese There's a lot whispers. of that. Hearn called him a hater <laughs> the other day. Yeah. Um, no. Uh, I think against Anthony Joshua. No, not at all. Nope. I think you know you know your stuff. You say it why um, no. Tell him. <laughs> tell him. You can't say it, I can. <laughs> he can call me white chocolate, but I can't <laughs> hey, reciprocate, can you, I? You can if you want. Can no? I call you white chocolate? Uh, what? I'm a Cabri's man. Yeah, Cabri's no, cream eggs, right, baby. Stop now. Stop now. Stop. <laughs> but in the last three months, he's been. I didn't a... actually answer that question. Let me. <laughs> I'm going to watch it back. Chocolate. If I've got to delete something, we're going to delete it. Trust <laughs> okay, me. No. I'm not getting involved in these no, politics. Me neither. Me neither. Um, um, what I'd say is, I I, I don't think. There is, I, you're definitely not a hater. Um, I don't know why would anyone would call you a hater. Um, I just think people have strong opinions in the sport. I do think as well, when, when, when you're in our sport, when, when, you, when you speak to people to their faces, most people are really good with each other. And even people that don't get on will speak with each other. Let me give you an example. Uh, uh, Boatze and Dan Aziz. These two are fighting, trying to smash each other's faces. Yeah. They're on holiday together at yeah. the moment. Now, it doesn't mean that the rivalry before they fought was fault because they had to get a job done. Yeah, but they're on a different level to... Yeah, yeah I understand. What I'm saying is it's about the, the nature of the beast. So when you're in our sport, we've got a job to do, but once, this, once the job's been done, you see fighters hug each other after fights saying, Yeah, they do. I, I know, but, but in, in the periphery of it all, opinions and the media, which yep. and because YouTube is media now, what you've got is people, you've got it's not what you do, it's the way that you do it. It's not what you say, it's the way that you say it. And there are antagonists in the sport. See Sometimes you play that game and you're selling things. I don't know what you're talking about. Sometimes... That's true, Johnny, you do do that. For, for effect and clout. Why would you say that? Eddie does that. You, you, Eddie does what? Eddie, he, he Eddie, things. Eddie. For clout. Yeah, man. Eddie's an antagonist. You're an antagonist sometimes, but you're doing it for a reason. You don't not say something for a reason. Um, there are, you know, Carl Froch is a big antagonist in... Well, he's in, king of it at the moment, isn't he? Carl Froch about winding, upsetting the apple cart. I, I love Carl. I love Carl because he's saying things that, that a lot of people are probably thinking, but don't say it, dare say it out, out publicly. And so that's why he's getting the reaction he's getting. And, and maybe that's what I'm saying. I'm saying stuff that... I think, or, or that most people are thinking, you know. But there's another side to how you think, because it is a sport of opinions. It's opinion. not mean. I'm not being no, mean. No, 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 no. no, no. All personal. No, there's, there's, a, there's, a, there's a spectrum of opinions on everything. Like, I, I think I spoke to you earlier. I can see four outcomes, and genuinely four outcomes to Nagano and Joshua on, Tell me them. on Saturday Tell night. Me them. I can see, um, I can see Joshua going hard early and winning, yeah. and actually breaking knockout Nagano up, knockout. Yeah. I can see Joshua boxing really well and hanging on at the end and just winning because uh, oh. Nagano comes back. I can see Nagano clipping Joshua and stopping him. That's the 20%. Yeah. Um, and I can see Joshua, Joshua break. No, no, I don't see Nagano winning on points. Um, I, I see Joshua. Do you disagree with that? I, 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 see, I see Joshua chopping him down like a tree and finishing him late in the fight as well. I don't see Nagano winning on points. I, I see this fight going the distance. Yeah. I see Anthony Joshua winning on points. Yeah. I don't see him knocking him out. I think Anthony Joshua will box him like he boxed Ruiz in the second fight, using his boxing ability. Common sense. Any coach will say to you, you have the bo better boxing ability than him. You're such why a would you? Why, <laughs> why would you yeah. give this man a chance that shouldn't have one in our sport? That's what it'd be. Let, let me ask you a question. You just said there that you don't believe that Joshua's going to knock out Ngannou, correct? If Joshua was fighting Ngannou for the first time before Fury had, would you have had the same 
opinion. No, 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 you know what? We all made the same mistake about Ngannou before he fought Fury. We all writ him off. We, we slept on him. Even, 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 sorry, even, sorry, even Tyson Fury did before they fought. They slept on him. And then we saw, we learnt by, we learnt by hindsight. Andy Ruiz, we slept on Andy Ruiz. Look what happened to AJ. The second time round, he got his shit in order and did a job. So therefore, in this fight, AJ's not going to sleep on him because yeah. he's thinking, that happened to him. No, that ain't going to happen to your, him. Your assessment of how the fight goes makes sense because what and you're basing it on, Nagano will probably try and box with the same shapes in the same way and the same patience as he did against Fury, but he's hittable. And when Joshua hits you, you feel it. And he should be able to The other thing it. is this. Joshua hits harder than Fury. Yeah, but yeah, definitely. Fury's a, a, a more unorthodox boxer than, than Joshua is. So Joshua is more static than Fury is. So that's why you've got to give Nagano some chance. Because he'll I'm, throw, I'm, it's that big when he's in range, he'll throw that's with him. It's that big if. So if he yeah, lands that's, with that power, that's why I'm giving, the, the argument is the big if. That's why, I'm giving, that's why I'm giving Nagano a 20% chance. What percent are you giving Garner to win the fight by knocking Joshua out? I agree, I think 20%. I think it should be a shutout. I don't should expect be. I don't expect Anthony Joshua to lose. I expect Anthony Joshua to beat him comprehensively on points. You know this as well because, you know, people forget you grew up tough as well and your family and your dad and, and had, had come over on Windrush and you grew up in a different era. The intangibles are there and the imponderables are there for Nagano because of his extraordinary life story as well and he may have something very special inside himself you know and Joshua for 12 years has been a superstar uh, so I spoke to Drew Cooper his, his coach I said has, anything, Cooper. Changed? Yeah. has yeah. anything changed with Nagano he said what do you mean I said well he got 10 million for his last fight he's getting 20 million for this fight so what does so 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 what does that mean has he become complacent has he become comfortable is he just thinking, you know what, I mean, I'm out. Oh, my. There you go. Who's just talking about you, actually? Even Edward. Is it, is it, right. is it a hate or what? Wall Street memes casino. I'm fine. And sportsbook.